this is the very first time ever I am laying my eyes on an Oasisaur. And look at that. What? It's a ginger rubber band Oasisaur. Dude. What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome! Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Ascended. That's right, we're playing here on the Scorched Earth server, having so much fun doing flips! My goodness, how's everybody doing today? I hope you're doing well, because me, I'm doing pretty amazing. That's right, because last episode, we got ourselves a couple of cool things. Yeah, for one, an ankle, which was absolutely needed. And because of that, check it out. Now rocking a long neck and loads and loads of ammo, including trank darts. So, yeah, pretty cool. We got ourselves also a very, very sick, shiny the spectral designation of the capro so yeah pretty dang awesome anyway today a couple of things on the docket for one uh gotta set up crops it's gotta be a thing so we'll get to that but i think today is gonna be a wyvern hunting day we got ourselves a gas mask yeah from taking on the enraged shiny last time and um because of that i think i'm gonna be brave enough to go into the wyvern den at least uh you know at least try it out test the waters dip my toes in it should protect uh, protect us against poison wyverns if we need it and i think i'm probably fast enough that i can outrun a wyvern now we might want to uh do a little test see before i go you know all in but uh, I, I think we do pretty good here. I, I think we can manage it. So that's all being said. Let's get all ready for the chaos that's about to ensue. And might as well remind you before I do, please remember to show that amazing support for the series. It helps me out oh so much by smashing that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, seriously, what are you waiting for? It is the perfect time to subscribe. All right, guys, let's do this. Let's do it. Let's dip our toes in our first time into the den. And I'm already seeing right down there. Check it out. Let's go ahead and put this on to protect us. I am already seeing a nest. All right. Can we outrun this guy? Come here, buddy, bro. Ooh. Um. I saw a little bit of red there. Let's see what kind. Okay. It's a fire wyvern. Not too worried about it. Yeah. It looks like we can easily outrun these guys. All right. Fair enough. Come on, buddy. Get ragged. First wyvern kill of the season. All right, let's see what we got for eggs. So, fire wyvern egg. Bada boom. What did that say? What level? 320. All right, we want to do better than that. We definitely want to do better than that. So, let's go ahead on through. That should have given us a couple of levels, too. I think we're all good on movement speed. Let's see. No nest. All right, we got a lightning wyvern. All right, and likely it's nest 360. All right, you gonna come after me, bro? Oh, I'm almost dead there. What the crap got me so much? Whoa, what am I taking so much damage from? Hold on, hold on. We we gotta we gotta dip out for a minute. Did the wyvern do that to me? I don't know how I would have taken that damage. What the crap? That's like almost all of our health. Ooh, this is not good. This is not good. I don't know what the crap did so much damage to us. Can wyverns hit through the mount or something? I mean, I know their attacks can, but I didn't think a fire attack could. Mm, I wonder if I was getting too hot and I didn't notice. I'm going to have to actually check the footage. I might have been that much damage this whole time. Holy crap. Let's get back to the base. I made, um, also, since we made the cooking pot last time, 
I made a couple of health potions, just the vanilla ones. And they are much cheaper than uh, the modded ones. So let's go ahead and grab those and get ourselves healed up. Bada boom, bada boom. But so far, three eggs, 360, 420, and a 320. All right, I'm going to keep on hunting. I'd like to do even better than that. But it's going to take me a hot second to get my health all the way up. So I'll see you right back. All right, healed back up, made a few more health potions as well. And I got to pay better attention to this. Um, I can't remember. Can wyverns, could they always, like, all their attacks go right through the mount? I thought it was only uh, a couple of them. I didn't recall the fire ones. Ooh, alpha fire wyvern. You think we're good enough? It's only one way to find out. There's only one way to find out. Would also give us some milk if we can do this. Holy crap. All right, let's uh, start to lead them outside the den. I'm not seeing any uh, damage. Oh. Not seeing any damage being taken just yet. Oh, yeah. Holy crap. That goes right through the mount. Oh, good lord. Good lord. Um. Oh, crap. We're going to be in trouble, guys. I, uh, I didn't remember it going through the mount. Have I just not known about this? I feel like this is new. All right, he's turning back. Um, we're going to have to rethink things. Holy crap. I don't know if I'm going to be able to uh, at least one-on-one -on -one go in and attack. Um, there is... I am curious about this. Our thorny dragon is not good enough to uh, go head-to-head -head with a wyvern. But um, especially, I mean, an alpha wyvern. But... If we could get a burning shiny, it's supposed to give you fire protection. I just don't know if it actually works because sometimes, you know, it doesn't. Stuff like that doesn't work for mods. Anyway, um, this is problems. We might have to uh, raise one of the wyverns we already have. I was hoping that we'd be able to go just right on in there because we're going to need the milk for raising it unless we want to use uh, the grow-up potions. All right, let me rethink this a little bit. All right, we're out of luck. There is no burning guys on the server. Again, don't even know if that would work. And again, yeah, it's kind of a, a walk-around thing of it. So we're going to have to keep our eyes open. Um, We can still get eggs from Wyvern, but we just... Oh, I guess we could still get milk because you can get it from any female wyvern. Um, but it's going to be dangerous. Um, I can't stay and fight, guys. So why don't we go through, clear out the den for the rest of the eggs we can. And um, I guess if uh, if we don't do a wyvern, uh, this is actually a really cool, a psychotropic Rex. Um, and it's only been on the server for an hour, so we have a little bit of time. I think we should check that guy out. Um, I also wouldn't mind testing. Like, we do have a burning guy, but it's a thorny dragon. It would be interesting to see if this actually works. See, it says fire protection. So, I mean, I suppose we could try it out. That I mean, that would be a game changer, because then uh, we'd be able to be on a mount. I'm trying to... I, I'm, it's crazy that I just do not remember this being a thing. Um, with fire wyverns, the fire going through the mount. Again, it's been so long since I played Scorched Earth. But uh, I don't recall it happening with with any other guys. So, yeah, it's going to be a little problematic. Um, definitely, uh, I'm not going to be able to um, 1v1 on this mount, the alpha. So... Is what it is. I don't know where that alpha wyvern went, by the way. I didn't see him on the way back. So, anyway, I guess we're just going to be running. And I can still take on some guys, but... Let's see. All right, we got another egg. Egg without a nest. Interesting. Uh-oh, that's a poison. It's kind of nice that it's not over... Oh, here he is. All right. Uh, 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 uh. Put it back on. 
I'm curious if this will protect me then. Because I I know it protects from other other ones. Yeah, it looks like it is from the poison. I mean, I didn't get a direct hit, but no health damage. All right. What do we get for a level? 420 again. They can go up, I think, above. Uh, I think we should be able to see some set up, up to 700 or something like that. 720 or 740 even is possible. All right, we got another nest, another poison. All right. Didn't notice the level 380. All right. Let's see what else we have. I'm not, if we don't get a high level one, I'm not going to even bother. Now, I think with, once we have wyverns, um, we will have protection at least against the fire, I believe. So that might have to be how we do it. All right. We have some electric guys. Um, I do, ooh, see right there, 780. Depending on when that guy turns shiny. Ooh, we got two eggs here. All right, come here. It's a shame that we can't just tame them. Oh crap! All right. Oh no, we got a fire guy. Oh crap. Oh, crap. All right. Big trouble there. Ooh. And we didn't manage to get the egg. All right. Uh, let's go back to the base. Oh. No. Um, open, te open teleporters and debank new base. <sighs> Today is not going to be as smooth as I first thought it might be, but that's okay. We'll make do. Let's make sure we can pull back our RG. Teleport dinos to your location and bling bling. All right. How you doing there, buddy? I think bling bling's actually doing fine. Yeah, it's us that's hurting. Um, I don't have the best armor that I could be rocking. So we could improve that too. I don't know if it would make much of a difference though with elemental attacks. Oh, I do want to go in though. Let's uh, let's go ahead and put these eggs into the fridge and uh, let's just make a rush in and grab that one egg. And then I think we're going to call it there. We're going to work our way back up. All right. I'm not too worried about this guy. Oh, that's a fire this whole time. Holy crap. I thought that was, um, oh crap. I thought this was an electric wyvern. Oh. Can we pull them out here? Oh, oh. All right, let's go in and grab his egg real quick. All right, quickly, quickly. There's multiple eggs there. Come on, come on. I think there was. Oh, should I be a turd and up, up, go up, go up. Let's pull these guys out of the den. I want to grab that other, oh, other one too. All right, how we doing? Holy crap. All right, go, 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 go. All right, coming in. There's the nest. All right. Oh, all right. Let's get the crap out of here. Is there any more quickies? Our health's getting pretty low. Mm, any easy ones? No. All right. I think we should probably call it here. Oh, 
quick, 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 quick. All right, got it. Let's get, let's just teleport back. Holy crap. Man, oh my goodness, come on. Come on, come on. Thank goodness there's no wyverns right there. We'd be dozed. All right, what did we get for eggs? We got 360, 360, 160. Yes, this is what we wanted, guys. Holy crap. All right, Um, one thing that I can do, I can hatch it out and then pick it up in the dino storage, and it should keep it in stasis. So let's go ahead. Let me put my hat on. That uh, Ascendant uh, gas mask doesn't last that long. All right, let's go ahead and make... Not in there. Oh, let's fridge these. A uh, Refrigerate these. All right, beautiful. Let's go ahead and make ourselves some ACs. All right, and with these ones, I got to activate them. That's why I like these, because you can turn them on and off, because they're kind of noisy. All right, let's go get our egg. Bada boom. And let's toss her out. All right, how are we doing? Let's put that away so I can see. Oh, it's going pretty quick. It's going pretty quick. All right, I'll see you guys back um, once we are just about there. All right, our egg is all set. It's ready to hatch. I was going to hatch it today, but you know what? I want to get the milk first. I want to hatch it all in the same day. So we're going to put that on the back burner. It was going to be a wyvern hatching day, but... And we still could, but I really want to get this Rex because I talked about it last episode. The psychotropics will make us the biotoxin, which we can use to upgrade our darts to make it easier to knock out wyverns. Ideally, it also, I don't know, a Rex might be able to take on Alpha. You got to remember, like, we're playing at level 600 maximum, so... An Alpha 600 is a lot different than an Alpha 150. So there, he's a tough cookie. We might be able to do it. I'm sure our dinos are strong enough, but I'd, I'd have to whistle at him. And what I worry about is our RG could, you know, fly up. It could go up and up and up all the way to the wor world border, and there'd be nothing I could do about it. So we need to get some heavier ground hitters. Our Thylas might be able to do it, but still... I think we'd be better off um, probably trying to knock out wyverns to get their milk. Um, so that all being said, uh, this Rex is going to be a heavy hitter and it's going to make the biotoxin over time. So let's go see if we can trap and tame that. All right. According to the shiny finder, we should see the Rex coming up soon. Yup, there it is. Oh, that is super cool looking. All right. Um, to trap this guy. Uh, nope, it's on you. I only have six that we have to work with. That's okay. That's okay. We will make do. Come here. Come here. All right. Let's hope that we can take the punishment from the racks. I think I am going to lure him over here, though. Um... Come on, come on. I feel like, I don't know. I feel more protected right here. Let's go ahead. Let's start to set up. So, boom. 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 All right. We just got to set down the last one. Come here, buddy. Come on. Come chomp on me. That's it. That's it. That's it. Oh, oh, oh. Can he get in? Oh, I think he's almost in. He might be considered in. Oh, I don't know if I want to set it just yet. Come on. I can't tell. Come on, just a little bit. Yes, yes, it, that's it, that's it. Did I get it? Oh, crap, I didn't do it. Did I get it? I think I got it. 
I got it. Yes! All right. Awesome. So now we can pretty much just peg this guy freely. Um, Let's scoop you. Awesome. Oh, there's Ruby on passive. All right. And now I can be safety of our mount and just start pegging this guy. Um, next thing. He prefers mutton. Does everything prefer mutton now? I don't know if he'll still be trapped if I crap. I got to start carrying around mutton. All right. Um, oh, this, this makes me mad. He's probably going to get untrapped. All right, mutton. And last remote location. Please still be trapped. Please, please. Yes! Oh, oh no, don't. No! That's what I was afraid of. Crap. All right. Let's do this again. We'll make it a little larger this time. All right, come on. We have all the room in the world. Come on. Come on. Get into our little, little thing. That's it. That's it. All right. Oh, crap. All right. Good enough. Good enough. All right. If you can get out of that, bro, I, I just don't even know. Should be fully trapped now. Dude, he's so cool. All right, this is going to take a while. This guy has almost 60,000 torpor. I think the highest torpor we've done so far has been pretty close to 20 to 25. Ooh, but it's racking up. It's not going to take that long, but I'll see you back once you're getting close. All right, we're getting close, guys. We're getting super close. Come on, buddy. Let's see. I'm curious if he's running yet. Are you in run mode? Let's see. Will you chomp me? Dude, look at those eyes. I'm so happy about this. I've been wanting one of these a lot. Come here, come here, come here. Boom. All right, we're at 55. We should probably start scoping out the area. It is a Rex. It's going to be super high on the uh, food chain. So I don't think anything's going to come after him. All right, come on. I just, I'm worried about this galley. If something goes and attacks, let's actually get him out of here. It'll give me a chance to survey. If other things came, and even if they weren't trying to attack the Rex, but, um, you know, they ended up hitting the Rex when they're trying to bite the other, that would not be good. And we're already not going to get a perfect tame because we're using mutton. And it's down! Because we're using mutton, we're already going to lose a level or two. So I want to ensure nothing bad happens. Anyway, um, it's going to be a hot second, so let's let them starve out. But hey, guys, we did it! All right, it's getting pretty sketch. Um, I've already had to take out a lot of just wandering uh, shenanigans. Um, let's uh, let's get it going on this, and let's see how far along. It may be done, but it may need a little bit more time. Let's see, 24, 36, come on. Come on, buddy. You can do it. Be done, be done. And... Come on, come on. We did it! Yes! Oh. Sherwood Psychotropic Rex is ours! All right, get packed up, buddy. Let's get back to the base. Let's make a saddle, and let's take it for a spin. All right, look at that. Let's get this. I think that's the last upgrade I can do. 184. Not bad. You did good, Thyla. You did real good. Let's uh, get you all packed up. Bada boom. And let's go out for a ride in a Rex. I am super pumped about this. All right. Let's go, buddy. And let's see here. 
pull. Bling bling. All right, let's go head on down here. I wouldn't mind seeing if we can get a death worm. That would be sick. Hopefully this Rex is as good as I'm hoping it to be. All right, bada boom. The only unfortunate thing is it is a male, so we're not gonna get eggs from it, but that's okay. I forgive you, bro. All right, saddle, boom. Wow, look at that guy. All right, let's get a little roar. Roar for the peeps and yes, so epic. All right, um, already can tell. Want to boost the movement speed a bit? Let's see. Hit, dude. I was expecting it's it's good. It's good. I was expecting more, but it's good. All right, fair enough. Let's go ahead and boost this up. It's gonna go up substantially though. Come on, buddy. Come on. All right, we should be over a thousand now. We should be well over a thousand. I'm hoping. Yes. All right, it's gonna level up real nicely. All right, come on, buddy. Let's get it a little bit higher and then I'm going to swap over to movement speed because we're going to want that if we're going to use this guy going through vast amount, vast amounts of desert. All right, come on. I'm curious, do, do I have a special move? No. All right, come on, buddy. Come on, come on, come on. All right, it's still uh, at least not probably in one day going to be an absolute uh, wyvern killer, but, you know, it's something. And look at that, already generated a biotoxin. So we have to be sure to leave this guy out overnight. All right, come on. Let's finish up. Oh, he's awesome. Okay. I think I can start boosting the movement speed. And, all right, so we're gonna get two a pop. I'll probably go up to 150 to 200 movement speed. And I think it will be quite the force to reckon with. All right, already feeling a little better. Come on, buddies. All right, so let me level them up for a little bit and I'll see you back once I'm at, you know, a good point. At least good enough to uh, perhaps take on a death worm. All right, we are pretty beefy now, guys. 100,000 health. I am at 176 movement speed, still working on it. But um, I think I'm going to start switching into the melee again. And I just got to hope that the death worm is not going to be like the wyvern situation where I feel I think that I'm ready yet severely outclassed. I don't know. We'll find out. So hopefully we can even find a death worm. Um, I'm just going to start running aimlessly through the desert. I've got my uh, desert gear on. I think we should be good. So let's see if we can see a sand pile coming up. I still wish that they had the old trick where you could zoom out like this and look through the sand to find where death worms were. Oh, that would be so good. But anyway wish me luck guys we're gonna do it it's gonna be a thing no death worm yet but look at this we've got a desert loot drop let's go check this out i'm seeing loads of these guys though around the new ones we're gonna have to check those out soon all right and of course fur gear just what i was hoping for dude see Ooh. Okay, well, I'll take that. Want to come again? Dude, that was crazy lucky. I don't know if I've ever seen that before. <laughs> what the crap? That's kind of cool. Um, Stego, no, not so much. All these stupid things. I wish they'd fix their loot pools to be uh, a bit more scorched earthy. All right, anything? All right, let's keep on looking, guys. Eventually, we're going to run into one. Let's just hope it's not an alpha. Oh, guys, 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 finally. 
I must have walked through like three sandstorms until finally just now I heard the sandworm. Come here, buddy. All right, what do we got? What do we got? It came up a little bit quicker than I expected coming from behind me. All right, yes, we're gonna wreck them. Oh, baby. Epic. So the deal with sandworms, they apparently are always at level one. So us being way higher uh, level, um, we kind of smash them. I don't know what the deal is going to be with the alphas if they are also only level one. But if they are, I'm not going to complain. It's just too bad the wyverns aren't like locked in at level 150 or 80 or whatever the crap they are. Oh, come here, come here. And get wrecked. All right, that was pretty cool. Um, I'm going to hate myself for saying this, but let's see if we can find one more sandworm just so that we can have uh, two deathworm horns for a possible mantis tame in the future. All right, no new sandworms, but this is the very first time ever I am laying my eyes on an oasisaur and look at what it's a ginger rubber band oasisaur dude i'm kind of afraid to hit it i'll be honest i don't know anything about these guys dude that's so cool i'm afraid it's gonna be like a um titanosaur or something you know what's gonna happen I seriously don't dare hit this thing. I don't even know if I can hit this thing. Hold on. What does it say? It needs a plant pot to tame. Interesting. Um, It's definitely not going to be around. Um, I think we could run away fast enough if something bad happened. I'm just, did I just shoot myself? I just shot myself. Come here, buddy. Oh, I got to look up how you tame this. It's so cool looking. Come here, buddy. And it's also only a level one. I don't know. We might have a chance just because of that. I'm so, like, curious about this. Come here. Can I bite you? All right. Let's see if I can... I just want to see if he aggros. Oh, oh, can I get a bite? Oh, nothing's happening. I don't think I put any Torpor on him either. Oh, oh, come here, come here. Oh, and listen. Oh, we're going to get it. 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 Come on. No. Oh, yes. Dude, that was epic. That's so silly, too. I would have loved to be able to get that, but I'll be honest with you, way too late in the episode. We'll have to keep our eyes open. Um, Still not seeing any death worms. I know these stupid sandworms are around somewhere. I know. There's going to be like 50 of them all of a sudden that just pop up on us. All right, I have officially walked around the entire map. We, I believe, live just right up there where that uh, white beacon is, that supply drop. I don't know. I don't know where all the sandworms are. What happened to them all? It's a little disappointing, but hey, at least we got to see one of them. We got this. I, I can't believe this, Rex. It is so beautiful. Just look at that. And in the time that it took me to walk around the entire map, we got ourselves 76 biotoxin. That's a score. So I'm pretty pleased. Um, And who knows? Let me see. How many Deathworm horns? What do you take? All right. That's a 320. It takes one. What do we need? 360. We might be. Who knows? Maybe with our raids, we can actually, with one Deathworm Horn, actually get a Mantis. So that would be super sick. 
But any last takers? That I think they're too afraid of us. I think that's what it is. It's got to be. What else could it be? They saw how quickly we creamed that last one. All right. But hey. Oasisaur. That is going to be epic. One day, guys. One day. But on that note, I think it's that time. Let me go through those comments. All right, guys. I just finished going through the comments. And yes, it is now that time. That's right. Time to name the dinos. For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, I go through the comments of the previous episode and I pick out all the most awesomest name suggestions that you guys leave in the down there. That's right. Just remember, if you want to have a chance of getting your name chosen, you got to be a subscriber. So smash that subscribe button. And yeah, just comment down below. And it could be you that gets chosen. Anyway, for today, we have the Anklo and the Capro to name. And their names will be none other than Big Bertha. Love it because it's a colossal one. It's bigger than normal. And Casper. I thought this was really clever. Casper with a K instead of a C being a spectral type. So pretty sweet. For next time, we need a name for this beautiful psychotropic Rex. And I almost forgot to point out. Check it out. Check it out. Whoa, when I lick them, do not lick a psychotropic Rex. Or this may happen to you. It's pretty cool. I like it. Anyway, guys, thank you all so very much for watching. It's been a pleasure. As you always do, please remember to show that amazing support by slamming that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, seriously, what are you waiting for? It is the perfect time to subscribe. All right, guys. See you tomorrow. Thanks again. And as always, peace out.